All right, this is Shooting Anybody 6, and I'm just going to go ahead and go through the GeForce Experience settings. That way you understand everything. Uh, no problem. So in Connect, just log into different things through here. Uh, pretty easy. HUD layout, you have camera, you can do where you want it, status, all these other things. Pretty simple. Uh, keyboard shortcuts, change them in here, or bind them, or however you'd like. Uh, recordings. This just tells you where tempor temporary files and where the actual recordings will go. So you can change it. As you see, I have it not on my Windows disk, but to another hard drive. Uh, broadcast live. So this lets you turn it on, gives you destination. Whenever you broadcast live, it also gives you the option of where you want to go. And then the settings down here. Whenever you're broadcasting live, I personally really like to do, I mean, you know, being crazy. If you know your computer can't support it, um, dropping that down, dropping the frames per second down, all that works. And then uh, for Twitch, I do 7 megabytes per second. My network is pretty solid overall and can do that. Um, so I definitely do that. And then, you know, obviously for Twitch, you want to do that. And you can go through the same thing for uh, YouTube. I have a little bit higher bit rate, but same thing overall. And I don't stream to Facebook, but, you know, same thing. Go ahead and mess with the settings. And then we're going to go to highlights. This just lets you know if you can, if they can use a shadow play for highlights. Like PUBG and stuff has the automatic, uh, you know, pulling highlights and stuff. And if you don't access them, they will automatically be deleted. This one right here lets you mess around with the microphone stuff. Um, so you can go ahead and up and down and all this other stuff. And you can also end up separating both of them. Whenever you stream, you don't want to do that. Uh, but if you're recording using GeForce Experience, it's definitely helpful to uh, be able to mess with your microphone alone. Um, coming down even further, this right here, um, once again, just overall settings. This is what actually is video capture, so whenever you're recording to your desktop, not streaming, this is what you're going to end up getting, and I hit that all the way up, 50 megabytes per second, uh, 1080p, 60 FPS, very solid. Notifications, uh, that's fine, I don't really mess with that. Privacy control, I do allow it to uh, view my desktop. Um, so there we go. That's all the settings. Pretty easy. Um, yeah, whenever you start, I mean, you can go into settings, change stuff. All that other stuff, you can turn instant replay on for the settings. Um, all that stuff. Uh, thank you so much for watching. This is Shooting Buddy 6 signing off. And remember, I'm always down to clown. Thanks.